Hello again, everybody. I'm Ron Hendren. And I'm Mary Hart. Two stars of the 50s are in the news today, one trying a comeback on stage, the other trying behind the scenes. I think my life was a fan magazine. It read like a fan magazine. It was a Cinderella life. But it wasn't real. But for the last decade, Connie Francis has lived a very real nightmare. Plagued by personal tragedy, she suffered a brutal rape and subsequent nervous breakdown. Her only brother was murdered three years ago. Then late last year, she was involuntarily committed to a mental institution by her father. My father was wrong in the way he did it, but he was not wrong in wanting me to seek help. You say your father was justified in doing what he did? No, he wasn't justified in doing what he did, and he wasn't justified in doing, in doing it the way he did it. But he was certainly upset and knew that I needed help, and uh, I wasn't looking for help at that time. You were in the hospital for three weeks before you gained your freedom. What was it like? It was a nightmare. It was a terrible period of time, and some of it I don't even remember. Is there ever a time when you, when you think about what you've been through, particularly in the last 13 years, and say, why me? No. I rarely feel sorry for myself. I think many of the things that happened to me were my own making. We all have losses in life. And to us, our, our own losses are monumental. But they happen to people every day in the week. And um, you just pick yourself up, dust yourself off, and start all over again. Jane Whitney, Entertainment Tonight. They lined up around the block at the Trocadero Transfer to hear Mamie Van Dorn resume her performing career after a lengthy time out. How are audiences reacting? Fantastic, especially the gays. I have a cult following now in Europe and all over from my teenage movies. And I was sort of the juvenile delinquent of the 50s, I guess. That's why uh, they have sort of called me the girl who invented rock and roll. For Mamie Van Dorn, live performances like this are part of a comeback that includes a record, film retrospectives, and a layout and playboard. In San Francisco, I'm Marilee Beck, Entertainment Tonight.